two poor artists. We're poor at taking a break in the fall, but mostly we're poor at making art. My name is Benj. And my name is Isaac. And today, if you live in the particular part of the country that we live in, at this particular time of the year called fall, you might have a break from school that they call fall break. Yep, that's what that's most people call it. Unnaturally long pause there, yeah. But for us teachers and bus drivers and students alike, and principals and... Do janitors get it? Possibly some janitors. Yeah, I mean, some might take it as an opportunity to clean... School nurses school. and secretaries and assistant principals. Mm -hmm. You get a week off of school. Woo! <laughs> Yeah, you know, it's a, it's a, a wondrous time of rest and relaxation and recharging and other words that start with R. Mm -hmm. Like rescuing your sanity from wherever it's been. Anyway, we're going to draw fall break because yep. that's what we're doing. That's fall what we're break doing. time. Time to get caught up on some rest and some video games and some well-deserved time with friends who also have the time off mm -hmm. or in your case flying out of the state to visit family yep gotta repair my grandparents house the whole thing from scratch yep i hope your repairing skills are better than your art skills <clears throat> or at least, at least i hope your bit. grandparents expectations are lower than <laughs> they should be <laughs> yep are you gonna hang one of our drawings in their house because that I'm, I'm trying to fix the house, not ruin it. If we draw, like, a picture of just hair, hair can cover a multitude <laughs> of sins, and you just, just put it all slap over. up a bunch of hair photos, like, no matter how bad whatever you fix looks, everyone's attention will be on the multiple portraits of hair. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I think yeah. <laughs> there's definitely truth to that statement. That makes me want to get, like, a picture frame mm -hmm. and, like, a wig and just, like, glue the wig to the picture frame make it just flow out of the picture frame mm -hmm. slap it on a wall and make like a million bucks that sounds but like of course real art. yeah of course that well, no it's not real art well it, what people it's what people call, call yeah art. like i'm i'm against such forms of yeah. art now if there was like ballpoint pen dripping out of the frame <laughs> then we could talk but you probably use too much ink if it's dripping mm -hmm. but today uh let's not drip let's not hair there might be hair there might not be uh, I'll draw some hair just for you. <laughs> you you really don't have to. I wasn't talking to you. Okay. I looked at you and I'm, I winked. But I'm, I was thinking I'm about the audience. On that's, behalf of the audience, the audience that's sitting in your proverbial chair mm -hmm. across from. Yeah, I'm talking on behalf of them. They don't want. They don't want that. All right. Well, no Although, promises. To be fair, they probably want us to just stop doing this. But we don't take a break in the fall. You already, <laughs> you already clarified that. Mm -hmm. No breaks for us. No break for the poor. <laughs> yep. All right, that's like a no break. For the... <laughs> how like true? A... How, how true? true? <laughs> yes. All right. Let's see here. Um, speaking of broken. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what are What are you gonna draw to symbolize fall break? Would you like to know? I would. Well, just be patient. You might just find out. First thing you got to do is start with three perfect circles. Mm-hmm. Like a, like a pizza with a single slice of pineapple in the middle of it. At what point in human history? Because, like, there's perfect circles in nature, mm -hmm. you know, like flowers and... Ah, that's about it. <laughs> the sun, the moon... <clears throat> but mm -hmm. at what point in human history, like how many thousands of years did it take before we as human beings were able to create a perfect circle? I mean, you know, how perfect do you require it to call it perfect? What like I just that, drew is, is not right. But I, but I just mean like, I think it was pretty early on that someone drew, you know, in the sand, you know, those a, a circle that most people would consider perfect. You mean like those people in the YouTube videos who take the whiteboard marker on those big college whiteboards and they like fling their arms in a mm -hmm. and they make like a perfect circle? You yeah. Know, people were doing that on sand like in yeah. the Garden of Eden. But, but you could also like 
like stick a stick in and like tie like a rope and do essentially a yeah, perfect but again sticks and rope like we're talking at least some amount of time into the future before they like, got that board like a few <laughs> you know like you don't just do that yeah for like they, they they at least named all the animals first yeah probably anyway perfect circles <clears throat> this is what they call a wheel. Uh, I thought it was a sliced piece of pizza with a pineapple in the middle. No, that's not a pineapple. No, it's like the thing that they. I don't even know if they do this anymore. Oh, yeah, like the little table. Yeah, like the little thing that they put in the middle of the pizza, so the mm -hmm. middle of the pizza box doesn't yeah. stick so to like the cheese. If there's any mice with you, you can use yeah, the table can, to feed you them. You can serve your yeah your <laughs> hamster, the hamster table. Is yeah. Like, yeah. They put on the pizza for, for you. Cinderella and her <laughs> compatriots. Mm -hmm. I've never understood. Oh, it's so that the box doesn't touch the pizza. Yeah, I just said that. You. No, this no, is your first time no, realizing I've, I've, why it's I've, there. No, I've known it before. <laughs> I I remembered uh, hearing it in the past. Quite the revelation, Ben. But like nowadays, the box stops the box from touching the pizza. Oh yeah, because we have like industrial strength, bioengineered cardboard now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that wasn't always Fold, the... folded when we were kids it was science uh this perfectly straight lines yep. perfectly straight mm -hmm. as all things should be thanks Thanos yep I'm done no uh you wish <laughs> you wish. like I know what you're drawing because I'm I'm looking at the thing you're looking at. I'm not following this, that very much. This um yeah. <clears throat> like I don't understand <laughs> what you're drawing. It's <laughs> it's kind of like an ugly fire hydrant with a wheel at the moment, <laughs> but that's not actually what it is. This, boys and girls, is a cannon that's upside down on a wheel, and it's broken. You want to know how broken it is? Oh, no, the other wheel. It's over here. What are those sticks that are sticking out? Broken sticks. <laughs> uh which is like a spoke. The outer part of the wheel, it's like <clears throat> off screen. <laughs> Broken. This one's missing a spoke or two. Cracked. 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 Cracked or cracked. Crack. I was going to say, it's pretty impressive that like the the metal parts are shattered. If you touch this, are... if like even like an eyelash lands on this, mm -hmm. it 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 is just gonna like pop into Not more pieces than a jigsaw puzzle. Mm -hmm. It's broken. It has had a break, you might say. <laughs> well, how did it break? Mm. You might ask. Probably from a fall. Oh. How. Oh. <laughs> Punny of uh -huh. you. This, ladies and boys and girls, and I left one out. Gentlemen, that's the good part. Anyway, um, this is in fact Humpty Dumpty. Mm -hmm. I think it's your turn. You're going to explain the history of Humpty Dumpty while I draw. Oh, I yes. can't both think about historical. Well, I can, but <laughs> I don't want to explain. Mm -hmm. That's most, really what it boils down to. <laughs> most people. Are stupid. Uh, I'm sorry, that was un uncalled for. Most most people that that have thought about the story of Humpty Dumpty have uh, like there's no there's no 100 percent guarantee of where Humpty Dumpty came from, but the, but most people think that the story came from a uh, cannon that was also named Humpty Dumpty, and it was during the war. Um, where the you know, you know you know the war in England. <laughs> what is that? 
over there, peeking its head in. Uh, we'll come back to that. Okay. <clears throat> so you guys know the song, right? You know, Humpty Dumpty a song, is had it's a like great a fall. Or a fairy, a nursery rhyme, they yeah, call it. It's like a song. Humpty, like you, I guess it is a song. Yeah, you like, you like singing it to a tune. But, you know, Humpty Dumpty had a great fall. And all the king's horses and all the king's men couldn't put them together again, right? Like I skipped some parts, but that's that's the song, right? <clears throat> yeah. The reason for that is the during the war that England had that was between the monarchy and parliament, uh, which, as you guys know, obviously the monarchy lost, and that's why they have essentially no power in England anymore. Um. <clears throat> well. In that, there's a battle. What's, what are these things? <laughs> Just like peeking out from the side. They're like worms. <laughs> <laughs> With eyes. That's not an eye. What? <laughs> Just keep telling the history. <laughs> Your job is distracting the people. <laughs> so... <clears throat> Uh huh. The history. So there is a there is a <laughs> cannon that was on top of a wall, and it was like it was like one of the biggest best cannons. Uh huh. Humpty Dumpty. And it was like an un, undefeated <laughs> defensive. Keep going. <laughs> it's like an undefeated defensive structure that the it was like towards the end of the war. Or like the monarchy is held up <laughs> in this. <laughs> it just keeps getting worse. <laughs> like what are these? <laughs> these are all the king. <laughs> all the king's worms. Ah. <laughs> uh. These are all the king's horses. <laughs> oh, 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 horses. Oh. The king's horses, Ben. No, all the king's horses. <laughs> I, I wonder why they couldn't put them together again. <laughs> the king got a very special, special breed. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. I'm definitely not on the keen side. <laughs> he has horses like that. It's just this one's nose. <laughs> <laughs> it's just smelling. <laughs> oh, goodness gracious. Mm. Yeah, so these are yeah. all the king's horses. They're going to yeah. try to, they can't put it together. So, uh, yeah, basically, the cannon was destroyed and they won <sighs> the war. Thank you for that distraction. <laughs> Those are the king's horses. Definitely not the king's sock puppets. <laughs> you know, maybe it is. Maybe this is all the king's men with their sock puppet horses. Yeah. Like, uh, no, it's like, you know how when when we were kids, oh no. we had like those sticks oh, yeah. with the like, yeah, like stuffed the, animal the head. Thing. Yeah, but like the, the real cartoony looking ones. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. Like they didn't look like a real horse it's head. nice perspective for horses. It's, it's, it, it's those like the king's men are holding these sticks running around <laughs> clacking their coconuts together <laughs> what is this <laughs> coming out the other side <laughs> just tell another story <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, so now you know. So you, everyone has that one friend, right? That's like, you want to know something disturbing? Nothing in the song ever says Humpty Dumpty was an egg. And, you know, so they're trying to, like, get at that it could be, like, a living thing. <clears throat> but now you can tell that person, you're right. It's not an egg. It's a cannon. <laughs> That's one of the king's men. <laughs> It's just such a surprise the king lost this war. <laughs> they had all their such a surprise. all their eggs in one basket with this cannon. Just another one of his men. 
<laughs> and why are they wearing clothes? <laughs> they might be. Oh, <laughs> yeah, this is the true story of Humpty Dumpty. <laughs> oh, it has a mustache. Had a great fall, this cannon did. Mm -hmm. oh, they're so baggy. <laughs> this is an old man. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> this is so derpy. <laughs> He's blind in one eye. <laughs> There's some liver spots. <laughs> That's definitely a man, not a dog. <laughs> All right. I, I am so... Disappointed in the king's horses and men. <laughs> and it has nothing to do with the fact that they couldn't put Humpty that one's not happening again. <laughs> okay. So, anyway, Humpty Dumpty. What is it? Humpty Dumpty sat on a wall, right? Mm hmm. He was up here. Top of this perfectly straight wall. Mm -hmm. It's like real small. <laughs> <laughs> The like, cannon wall. The, the, it's just a wall just for that cannon. Yeah. It's not it up here. the castle wall. And it fell. Yeah. The cannon fell off its wall. Ah, uh, this is this. And it broke. So it had a fall. I don't even think it's hit the bottom yet the way I just drew it. So it's, it, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's, 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 uh, it, it's, it maybe it bounced. Yeah. I mean, it bounced off the wall. Because, I mean, something had to make it fall, right? Mm -hmm. You don't just fall for no reason. Unless you're really accident prone. Yep. So, it's fallen off the wall. And it's breaking. And all the king's horses. And mm -hmm. all king's men. Yep. They can't put it back together again. Because it fell. That, and it that's, how, that's how it goes. Yeah. All break. See, I was trying not to. This didn't work, but I was trying not to draw the hindquarters of the horse so mm -hmm. that none of it was sagging. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. But I, I understand that <laughs> goal, but um, I think this is worse. <laughs> this one really needs my help. <laughs> what are you doing? Drawing a dark black outline around him? I don't know. It looked better before. <laughs> I don't know what you expected the dark <laughs> outline to do. To really accentuate the facial features. <laughs> How do you spell nay? <laughs> we need some... N-E-I-G-H. That's how I'd do it. It's like a sad nay. Like, no. But an explanation point. It's loud and sad. <laughs> <laughs> what are the humans gonna say? Oh, poodle de dum. It's puddle de dum. Oh, that's an app? Yeah, fuddle de dum. Okay. The old timey exclamation of despair. Mm. Uh -huh. I see. Yep, 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 yep. Let's be done with this. Uh, fall break, everyone. Mm hmm. That's what he drew. Fall break. Right there. Can't True. you see it? The fall. See, at least break. it was somewhat educational through all the peals of shrieking laughter. It was. <laughs> He learned the true story of Humpty Dumpty, and he wasn't mm -hmm. just some egg man that was sitting up on a wall. Like yeah, that doesn't freaky... even make sense. That's weird. Yeah, that doesn't make any sense at all. Instead, it was, it was this: a cannon, and all the king's horses, and all the king's men, which were much weirder than you ever thought. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah, this is what they looked like. This is why they lost the war. This is what the historical records claim. Mm-hmm. 
<laughs> that cannon is going to shatter into a million pieces when it hits the ground that's somewhere down there. <laughs> yep. I don't even know how these people are up so high. <laughs> like, <laughs> <laughs> you have to assume the ground is like right below where I drew. Yeah. But, yeah. Well, but there's still the question. Like, are they standing on top of each other? <laughs> like the guy on the top. So much taller than the guy Some, on the bottom. It's not, it doesn't take much explanation. Some people are just taller than other people. By that much? A whole wall's height difference? <laughs> Some people are really short. Some people are really tall. Because like if that guy was standing up, he would be taller than the wall. I, I keep looking at this. I don't know what this is. It's not a, it's not a human. <laughs> it's like something... <laughs> Something else. Yeah, we should see what I draw. Please draw get, something better. Just see, get but, this but away. But there's no saggy butt horses because mm-hmm. there's no butts. Yeah, that's true. There's just <laughs> normal horses. <laughs> no, <laughs> don't know if I would say that. Maybe they're camels. Maybe these are the king's camels. To get <laughs> so often left out of the out of the picture. Yeah. <laughs> all the king's People. camels and all the king's clowns. <laughs> And also him <laughs> and and, and Philbert, the, the ugliest man in the kingdom. No, no, no. Philbert, the dog man. <laughs> like we did uh, a terrible experiment on himself. Yeah. He used to be the court wizard until <laughs> some terrible mishap. He couldn't put the king, he couldn't get Humpty Dumpty together either. We're not even sure why he came. The king definitely didn't summon him. Uh, please take over. Yes. Fall break. Yep. Fall break is a great thing. Because it's finally, at least in Arizona, it's finally like nice enough out to where you can leave your house without risk of death. Mm-hmm. The weather is cooled down to where you won't literally die if you sit in your car too long. and It's just an all-around great time. The cactus needles start changing colors. and Every bird from the entire... From all of Canada ends up here because they're all flying south. Mm-hmm. And it's a great time for gargling, which is what you seem to be drawing. Or vomiting, or... Licking. 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 Do they have like a snake tongue? Ew, what is that? It kept... Oh, it's an arm. (laughs) His neck is too short. (laughs) Did you learn nothing? Whoa, what is that? It's like a spatula. (laughs) It's a new one for the hand mangler. Spatula hand. <laughs> She's, he likes to keep up to date. Maybe this guy lost a whole hand and he just like replaced it with a rusty spatula. Like the hash slinging slasher. If you don't know who the hash slinging... Oh gosh. Stop giving... Stop doing good. Oh, okay, I think. Oh, no, no, now it's like 3D. If you're going to follow up my drawing from today, it has to be worse. So that people are like, man, I missed that original drawing. (laughs) The camels and clowns and Filbert. This person's either being attacked by a swarm of ants or falling. Yeah, they're falling. And seeing as though, yeah, we're not drawing fall ants. Fall ants is when your ant comes during fall break. Mm -hmm. And you have to spend your whole time taking her to every tourist trap in town. Is that, is that what you have to do? It's it's the social etiquette requires it. This is actually... Don't you hate it when you fall out of the window in your sleeping bag? <laughs> <laughs> it's a female. It's a dress. At, oh, yeah, females are allowed to have sleeping bags, too. It's 2023. These are her legs. <laughs> I like how one of them goes the opposite direction as the other one. Like, the thigh is where the calf is supposed to be. Well, she's fallen. <laughs> what is that? So, like, all the muscle and fat in the thigh has transferred to the calf? And it's done the opposite on the other leg? Yeah. This lady's got leg issues. She's falling with 
She has two hands. Are they both spatula shaped? <laughs> Those arms look like they're locked in the straight Fa position. Like consistent. there's no elbow. She has. She a, walks kind of like a nutcracker. She has like a flower pattern on her dress. Oh, wow, this is lovely. This is lovely. I mean, she's falling to her death, but it's at least it's lovely. So, and there's like the the you know the usual like falling. Yeah, I love it lines. when I drop something in the kitchen, and you can see those lines, and you can grab onto one of them mm -hmm. and pull the thing back up. Uh... Ah, fiddle dee dum. I'm falling. That's what she's saying. Hmm. That is not the typical thing. Someone screams when they're falling. They <laughs> might you might yell it right before they start falling. But usually there's just they're like, like yeah, a... They're like, as she's falling, she's just saying that. She's very self-aware. <laughs> yeah. And then... This is like when you like are in a dream and you come to the like, wait, oh, I'm falling in this part. Like, I just realized what was happening. Mm-hmm. But we've got, fortunately, you know how, like, <clears throat> there's different, like, supernatural creatures that exist? You mean, like, angels and demons? No, I mean, like, fake ones. Oh, you mean, like, like don't exist. Like mythical creatures. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Like, like, there's... Like narwhals and anteaters. Like, they're, you know, like, fairies and stuff. So, we've got, we've got this one. That That's called a about. baseball. And it, like, <clears throat> that looks like something you draw. Oh, never mind. Is that a is that a person? <laughs> it, like, I hate those stick figure fairies. Those kung fu yeah. stick figure fairies. <laughs> and it from, looks like from Chinese lore. It's breaking like the fall line. Oh my goodness! It's breaking Not. the fall line. So wait, if and you break you... the fall lines, more. So, like, have you ever heard that story of the lady that fell from terminal velocity and survived? I have. It's because these things <laughs> came and broke the fall lines. The, like, not all of them, so she still got hurt. The stick figure kung fu fairies? Yeah. They break Here, the fall me, lines. They, let me draw, like, it has, like, wings. Sure, it's not a backpack. <laughs> it might be a backpack. <laughs> People are unsure. Yeah, yeah. I mean, you know, it's, it's hard to see when the wind's in it your just, eyes when you're it falling. Just comes in, breaks the fall lines. <clears throat> so, like, what happens to her? Does she just like get stuck in the air? No, like if he he doesn't if he only breaks like some of the fall lines, then she'll still fall and, like oh, it hurt, but it won't be as bad. You just slow down. Yeah, like these are like gravity defying kung stick figure mm -hmm, kung fu fairies. Yeah. They just like jump out. Of break where? The fall lines. Wait, jump out implies there's somewhere they're jumping out of. Yeah, out of the fall. Like a man? <laughs> like these came <laughs> after the fall. <laughs> mm hmm. So they are like demons. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, sure. Yeah, I don't know how I feel about this anymore. <laughs> I'd be like, no, go, go away. <laughs> go away. <laughs> <laughs> She's like snapping all the fall lines. Yeah, like <laughs> do it. And it's always like through kung fu. <laughs> well, as you do, it's yeah. a lot of. She also Based had... on the amount of kung fu movies I've seen, I would believe you can kick the fall line. Like Crouching Tiger, Hidden Dragon, <laughs> they never have fall lines. <laughs> like someone's always kicking out their fall lines. She also had a cat. Oh. <laughs> Uh, I have a feeling I know what's going, what guess is going to happen here. Oh, it's a jack-o'-lantern cat. <laughs> oh. No, it's a... Benj, that's a cute cat. You did good. And the cat's also falling. Is that... What the heck is that? It's its arm. What the heck is that? It's its other arm. Oh, well, mm. This is its tail. Bench. It's I like a this... pancake. <laughs> oh, this... oh, it's 3D. Oh, man, you did another good thing. <laughs> sort so of. This cat's it's, falling. It's a weird flying squirrel type cat. <laughs> yeah. But there's one of those stick figure guys, like, standing on it. Like, 
<clears throat> weighing it down. Yeah, it's not. <laughs> like, it's, it's not. not it's not. It's gonna, not kicking. It's not the, helping the no. cat. It's like, oh, you better, you better. It's like you're trying to make it not land on its feet, but then you have like a cat one. <laughs> a cat, a stick figure, cat kung fu fairy. Yeah, has like cat ears, and it's it's Man. gonna like. It's going to help it land on its feet. This is an epic battle. <laughs> so there's like, there's like cat ones that like always help cats make sure they land on their feet. And this but is like the, a, the other ones are like, like, like this guy's like over here saving her and is like, Hey, go make sure that cat doesn't, doesn't land. I can't like, I'm conflicted because I feel like these things are evil. But they're also trying to make a cat fall, which isn't evil. But they're also just evil, clearly, because they're trying to make the cat die. Mm -hmm. So, like, I don't know how to feel about them. Do I do I like them? Is there, are these my new favorite mythical creature? Yeah, the the kung fu stickmen. Yeah, that just blow your fall. By karate chopping and kicking the uh -huh, like, ball lines. Like, these would be cool. Unless they're, like, really evil. <laughs> and then, if they're really evil, then that means she's probably, like, terrible. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like, you know, like... like Hitler's mom. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, something something like that in her flower dress. <laughs> like, she, she doesn't seem evil to me. No. But, like, she's about to... Like have Hitler, and they're sa saving her. Uh, see this, draw of, this like, drawing is, is going. It's going down right. in flames. This drawing. But oh, no, I'm not saying that's the case. They might be good. So when when the saying so because I've never quite understood the saying "break your fall." Mm -hmm. Yeah, that that's where it comes from. These guys. Yeah, like break your fall. These like if you fall, breakers. you break something. You don't break your fall. Yeah. Like the chair. Like if you fall on like the kitchen table and the table like explodes, mm -hmm. like it broke my fall. It's like no, you fell and broke the table. Right. Like this is a literal breaking your fall. Yeah. I just didn't know there was mythical stick figure, demon, fairy things. Mm -hmm. Yep. They break. That were involved. They break people's fall. And who knew cats had such like a deep spiritual warfare thing yeah, going every on? Every time like, they fall, it's like it's like one the... of these stick figure ones and one of the cat ones fighting yeah. against each other. Mm -hmm. And like every one out of like nine out of ten times, the cat one wins. Yeah, because they always land on their feet. Yeah, but like nine lives kind of thing. Like, yeah, that one's just hoping it's <laughs> it's out. <laughs> this is the tenth last time. time. Yeah. <clears throat> this is a deeply deep drawing. <laughs> I think it's fun that we both drew. Um, like we didn't plan this, but we both drew mythical creatures. I drew <laughs> <laughs> which which one's the mythical creature in yours? I think it's a hard better question to ask. Which one's not? <laughs> like, <laughs> uh, Filbert is, is not natural anymore. Um, <laughs> the horses, let's be real, they're all real. Yeah, like, <laughs> normal horses, uh, but. <laughs> Oh, but Lord yeah, <laughs> that's pretty. That's pretty. Uh, that's pretty good. This there's a lot. To, this makes me think of a lot. Of, like, this is gonna screw up somebody's belief about how things work in the in the world. <laughs> you know. Mm -hmm. And isn't that just how art should be? Like, so if you go and jump off of a high surface, which we do not recommend, the two poor is... artist legal team would like to interject. And they're, they're handing me a, a paper. Just <laughs> listen to the rustling of. Papers that I'm clearly being handed. They're, they're silent papers. It's like vinyl paper. We have noise suppression on these microphones. Yeah, that's it. Uh, what am I reading? Oh, the two poor artists do not condone anybody jumping off of anything ever. But if you did. But, to, to, but you shouldn't. Yeah, but if you did. But if you did. <clears throat> there's the possibility that you would see one of these stick figure men breaking your fall. They, they don't do it very often. Like how many cases of people... Falling from terminal velocity to ride. That's true. It's like one. Yeah, you hear about those people who are like, our plane fell out of the sky and then somehow it gently landed in a tree. And you're yeah. like, hmm. Like you hear about it every once in a while. It must have been a stick figure. Yeah. Every once in a while you hear about it. Stick but it's, figure. It's, it's rare. Kung Fu fairy. Real rare. Yeah. 
this is how it happens. People see people understand the phenomenon with cats, but they don't understand the invisible forces at play. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Now we do. Exactly. You understand the true history of Humpty Dumpty, and you understand the true workings of nature. Yep. <laughs> it's been a good day. Goodbye. Goodbye. As always, we're surprised you made it this far into our video. There's no way we could possibly ask you to subscribe to this atrocity, so we won't. We would say share it with your friends, but it's probably better for wasting your enemy's time. We're probably not going to get any better, but we will keep drawing. See you next time.